हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम संजय गुप्ता इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट कंडीशनल स्टेटमेंट्स सिंपल इफ देर आर टोटल फोर टाइप्स ऑफ कंडीशनल स्टेटमेंट्स आर अवेलेबल इन विच फर्स्ट वन इज सिंपल इफ सेकेंड इज इफ एल्स थर्ड इज नेस्टेड इफ and fourth one is else if ladder these conditional statements are used to evaluate a particular condition so that we can identify whether it is true or it is false so in this tutorial we are going to focus only upon simple if so let's take a look on syntax of simple if in this syntax there is a condition enclosed in parenthesis parenthesis if this condition is true then a particular statement can be executed so simple if focuses upon true part of the problem we can also write the syntax as if condition then curly braces statement 1 statement 2 up to statement up to statement number n then closing of curly braces so if we compare both the syntax then we can identify that if we have more than one statements then they have to enclose in curly braces and if we have only single statement then curly braces are optional as you can see this note first point is if there is only one statement then braces are optional otherwise they are compulsory second point else is optional in if statement so if there is a requirement of false block then we can attach else with the if but if we do not require false block then we can avoid else with in if statement now we can understand the working of simple if with the example so program 1 which says check whether a number is positive so we have to check only the positive positive part of the number so in this program using printf and scanf we are going to read a number from the user using this if statement we are going to compare n with 0 so this condition says n greater than 0 so if number is greater than 0 then printf statement will print positive on the console so if this condition is true then only positive will print if this condition is false nothing will be printed on console program number 2 it says check whether a number is between 10 and 20 so again we have to read a number and we are going to check uh, this range that that number lies between 10 and 20 so again using printf scanf we are going to read a number from the user now in this if condition there are two situations first says n greater than 0 second says n less than 0 and these two conditions are joined by logical and operator so logical and operator checks both the conditions if both the conditions are true then only it will print the true part of the problem otherwise nothing will be printed because we are not using else with this if statement so if this condition is true then yes number is between 10 and 20 will be printed on console and if this condi condition is false nothing will be printed on console so this is all about simple if thank you